Hi, I'm David Cooper from Clavinova Clinic. Today I want to show you how the full keyboard setting in the chord accompaniment section will work. It's a really clever system where it will follow you as a pianist and allow you to get the accompaniment from the, the keyboard functions of the instrument. So this will work on all Clavinova CVP models. And if we go into the chord feature, make sure it's turned on, and then we go to the split and fingering, we can make sure that we've got full keyboard chosen. Now what that means is if I play any three notes on the keyboard that make up a chord, we'll get the accompaniment coming through. So if I play three notes here, okay now at the moment I've got no rhythm section turned. Let me turn the rhythm section on and I'll play and you'll hear the bass coming through. And that's nice, I'm playing an F chord, it's showing me that I'm playing an F chord, but I can play it anywhere on the keyboard. So I can play up here, And anywhere I play three notes, so what it's doing is actually playing the chord that I'm playing, but it's giving me a rhythmic accompaniment. It's playing the bass, maybe some guitars or something in the background, and it's it's sort of jazzing it up to make it more fun, and it's giving me a, a nice accompaniment. So depending on what style I've got chosen, that will give me a suitable backing. Now I might want to play a bass note with my left hand. I could play an F bass down here and I could play uh, two notes at the top here. As long as they make a chord, it shows me that the F, A and C are making an F chord and it plays that backing for me. So if I play a chord and a bass again, Anytime I play a chord between my two hands, it's playing the rhythmic accompaniment with that. Now, um, I've even known of a, a, a one-handed person who can get away with playing the piano because you can actually play chords with your right hand and it will follow them. So if I play now, uh, and the other thing it will do is it allow you to play single notes in between. So if you look again as I play that. doing is it's taking the chord, as soon as it gets three or more notes it's making the chord out of it and it's changing the accompaniment, but it will carry on with that accompaniment until you get to um, playing a different full chord. So as I was playing that, I was playing a chord, it triggered off the backing and then my single notes weren't a chord so it wasn't changing the bass and the accompaniment. And that means you open you up to so many different things that you can do with it and it's a really useful feature. So full keyboard, great if you want to play one handed, but you can play your full piano music and as you change in your uh, both hand playing, any chord that comes through, it will trigger off the different bass and the rhythm section for whatever style you've got on. So if we had it set to standards and jazz, and we put on here, um, let's go to acoustic jazz, when we play now, follow your chords and it's a really great feature and if you're a pianist by uh, originality then that's a great way to use the rhythm section on a clavinova. I hope you found that useful.